and some squats. Uh, it's one of my favorite exercises because it's so great for your butt and your legs. So you're going to get into squat position, toes pointed outward. You're going to go down and we're going to bounce five times. Come back up. So we're doing this six times total, so five more times. Make sure you're really sitting your butt back if you're feeling your butt. Back up and go down again. Keep your back straight. One last time. Now we're going to start off with bouncing lunges, which are really great to target the butt. So you're going to get into lunge position here, and we're going to bounce 40 times. You should really feel it in your butt. Go low. Going. Make sure your weight is on your heels so you're really feeling it in your butt. Keep your back straight. Almost done. And come up. Alright, now let's do 40 to the other side. Get into a lunge stance. bouncing lunges each side. So now we're going to be doing some side to side hopping squats. So you're going to squat down and hop to switch. So it's really great for your butt and your legs. Make sure you squat all the way down. Go low. your butt back, keep your back straight. This one's really great to tone up your legs. squats. So now we're going to do rotating planks. It's really great for the core and the upper body. Let's get into plank position. Back straight. Rotate to one side and then switch. side bends which is also great for your core so you're gonna be on your side here like this you're just gonna bend come back up so we're gonna do um 15 per side let's go down come back up all right that was 15 on one side now switch sides to 15 on the other side.
curtsy lunges, which are really great um, for the side of your legs and your butt. So you're gonna have one foot on the side of cardboard and the other foot behind you into the side. So you're gonna go down into a lunge, come back up. Go all the way down. Keep going. All the way down. You should feel it in the side of your legs and your butt. Let's do 30 to the other side. Down, back up. Keep going. Go low. Come back up. And those are the curtsy lunges. So now we're going to do 20 hand walks. Really, really great for the upper body and the core as well. So you're going to start off here, your feet on the board. You're going to walk forward and back. And forward again. Keep your core tight. Those are our plank walks. So now we're going to do calf raises to really tone up our calves and our legs. So you're going to get about a foot apart. You're going to go up, so you tippy toes and back down. So go all the way up and back down. We're doing 30 in total. the rest of your body completely still, just focus on using your calves. Ah, 
And those are our calf raises. So now we're going to do the tricep press plank, which is great um, for your arms, your triceps, and just toning up your whole upper body. So you're going to go down to your elbows, back up to your hands. Twenty tricep press planks. So for our last exercise, we're going to be, do we're going to be doing twenty bridges. So um, you're going to place your feet there, your hands on your side, and you're going to go all the way up, squeeze your butt, come back down. All the way up, press up from your heels, squeeze your butt, back down. So twenty in total. Keep going all the way up. Sweet. Make sure your weight is on your heels. Keep going. Oh, and those are our bridges. So once again, those are some workouts that you can do on the Posada Power Board. They're really effective and work every muscle in your body. If you're really advanced, you can even try this twice. So once again, I'm Vicky Justice. Please like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time. And to find more information about the Posada Power Board, make sure you check out the website below.